Hey Valerie, this is a screencast from a game Organon. It's a horror type game made in Unity, um, where the main objective is to collect three keys and to kill all the enemies in the area. Uh, before I start, I'm just click on the how to play button. And that just goes through all the instructions on how to play the game. Um, there are basic enough instructions, like most other games. One and two to change your weapons, uh, right click to aim, left click to fire, spacebar to jump, and then I can just go back. And then I start the game. Now, here is the main game itself. Uh, to look around, I can just move the mouse. And here we see this knight character talking to us. And you can see in the bottom left hand corner there, he's telling you to collect all the keys to close the port. And that little dialog box is just a trigger, so that will go on and off as I leave him. Now, these huts here and this portal was all made in Blender. The terrain that you see was made with Unity's terrain tools. Um, to move the character I'm just using was sad and if I hold down shift I'm sprinting and you can see my sprint meter in the bottom right hand corner there slowly go down as I sprint. You can also see the minimap move with the character. The character is a little blue blip on the minimap and I'll just follow the character around. And now if I right click with the mouse I can swing my axe, and if I press the 2 button on the keyboard, I can bring out a bow. And if I hold the, oh sorry, if I hold the um, right click on the mouse and left click, I fire. And the same with the axe, it's left click. So now if I go up here, you see some enemies patrolling the area. Now, all these enemies are now in a patrol state, so they're just walking around aimlessly with no real goal. But if I get close to one of them, you can see now that I've activated his chase state, and he is chasing me around the map. And if I get close to him, he'll like enter an attack state, and he'll try to attack me. And you can see my health going down there. And then I can come back. And after five hits, he's dead. Um, now, before I move on to the game, I'm just going to quickly show you the um, the the death mechanics. So I'm just going to go up to this group here. And you can see here it says I died, and I can play again or quit. So let's go play again. And that was the death mechanics. You can also see in the top left hand corner of the screen there, there is a keys left um, piece of text. And that's just telling me um, the amount of keys I have left before I can go back to the knife. Now another mechanic I want to show is as you can see, I'm far away from the chase distance of this skeleton. But if I hit him, oh, if I don't miss, there we go. Um, you can see now that I've activated his chase state, and he's gonna chase me around because he noticed that I've hit him with the arrow. Also use spacebar to jump around, or if I press R, I can crouch down to get a better angle. Oh. Now, I'm just gonna clear this area. Now, this green orb, this is a health pickup. So if you look down to the right, you can see my health is fairly low, but if I pick it up, my health goes up. And here one of the keys that I have to collect. This was also made in Blender by me, as you can tell. It's not the best. And now I'll just do the same in the next two areas. 
Now each, now the da, um, the axe and the bow have different damage rates. The axe has a damage rate of 20 other rate, so 5 hits to kill the enemy. While the bow has a damage rate of, I think around 40. So, 3 hits kills the skeletons there. Okay. I've just collected a key there as well, so I'm going ask you now. Another mechanic I want to show off is I'm just going to turn the attention of maybe this place. Now you can see they're all chasing me. But if I run now away from them after a certain distance, see they lose interest in me and they go back to patrolling. Which are the three main states of the enemies. was found in the Unity Apple Store and I just added some ambient creepy music just to make the game feel a bit more eerie I guess. There's also fog as you can see added around so the further away the cam um, you see from the camera the more foggier it gets. And that's also just to make a bit of ambience. Collected all three keys, I just go back to the knife and I'll win the game. Music's play, it's all nice and sunny, and all is good. So, yeah, that's a screencast of my game. Hope you like it, and thank you.